We present the method for real-time egocentric hand pose estimation using a single commodity RGBD camera. Our method can track hands and scenes with cluttered backgrounds, occlusions and complex hand object interactions. Tracking hands from chest, shoulder or head mounted cameras has many potential applications but is a hard problem due to occlusions, background clutter and field of view limitations. Our method works even if the interacting objects have the same color as skin. We address this challenging problem by combining a convolutional neural network based 3D post regression framework with a kinematic skeleton tracking strategy. We first create a color depth map from the input depth map and color image produced by a commodity RGBD sensor. We divide the task of hand pose estimation into several steps. In the hand localization step, a hand localization network or HALNET produces a heat map encoding the position probability of the hand root. With further processing, we obtain a crop around the hand and a 3D position of the hand root, even in the presence of clutter and occlusions. In the 3D joint location regression step, the normalized hand crop image is fed into a joint regression network, or JawNet, to obtain 2D position heat maps and 3D joint locations for 21 joints in the hand. Finally, the 2D and 3D joint location information is combined in a post-tracking energy to produce temporally smooth joint angles of a kinematic skeleton. Both HALNET and JawNet are trained with large amounts of synthetic data which was captured using a mixed reality approach. We captured real hand motions with an existing hand tracker and retargeted it to a virtual hand model. We can then animate the hand to sample important dimensions of variability such as pose, skin color, shape, texture, background clutter, camera viewpoint and hand object interactions. We now show real-time tracking results produced by our method. To evaluate egocentric hand pose estimation methods, we introduce a new benchmark dataset with over 1400 frames annotated for 3D fingertip locations. Here we show results of our method on this dataset. The sequences in the dataset cover diverse cluttered scenes, notable occlusions and diverse hand object interactions. We now compare different variants of our method and also with previous work. Using both RGB and depth data together improves pose estimation. Our combined 2D and 3D pose tracking formulation outperforms using 2D or 3D only. The 2D pose tracking energy alone produces large incorrect depth variations. Our method also performs well in scenes similar to the ones shown by Rogers and colleagues. However, our method runs in real time and produces temporarily smooth tracking results. Our method is also able to estimate motion in egocentric views similar to the one shown by Srida and colleagues. Their method exhibits a sliding effect since it was not designed specifically for egocentric settings. Commercial solutions like the leap motion also fail in our capture space. Our method still fails when the occlusions are too large or when the hand is too close to the image edge. Here we show some more results of real-time tracking. Our method can reliably estimate the pose of the hand even when large portions of it are occluded.
and in the presence of considerable camera motion. Thank you.